up y'all it's me sister girl tuesday back at it again with another video back at it again with another review for you so i'm very excited about today's review because tate's was one of my all-time like top tier cookies store bought that i could get because they taste like they came out of somebody's kitchen and i just love that but they were made with dairy like you could taste the butter in it and I think that's what made it so good so I am very excited to let you know that Tate has the new craft baked crispy thin scrumptious vegan vanilla maple cookies you've seen it right here y'all you see it I'm excited to try this because I've never had this flavor in the non-vegan version so it's gonna be new to me and I'm also excited because, you know, like what's taste without getting the classic? So I got the classic chocolate chip, but vegan, of course. So let's sample. Okay, so I want to try the flavor that I've never had before. So y'all know Tate's comes in two cartridges. Cartridges. Mmm. Mmm. You know what this smells like? This smells like if you ever had homemade pancakes and then like that one piece of pancake that's just drenched in the syrup that's left on your plate and it's got the crispy edges, that's what this smells like. Y'all! <clears throat> this right here is decadent. This one of them cookies you need milk with because it's sweet, boy. It is sweet. Um. Okay, so serving size is two cookies. There's 12 grams of sugar. Mm, it's a sweet, y'all. <laughs> it's really good. It almost makes me feel like I kind of want, either if I don't have milk, then I want like some coffee or coffee substitute just to go with this. It feels that it, it's like it needs something warm. It, it's Mmm, I don't, it's like, it's giving holiday cheer, but also it's giving, I don't know, but it, ooh, I'm gonna have to put this down. I don't know if I can eat the whole thing right now. All right, into this chocolate chip. I'm really excited, y'all. Yikes. Yo, I need a palate cleanser in between these cookies. Mmm, I can smell the chocolate. You know how chocolate chip cookies just have a smell to them? Like, I don't quite know what it is, but you know what it is? Mmm. Smells good. Hmm. I like the cookie. It doesn't taste like a Tate's original. If you're looking for that original Tate's vegan, or that original Tate's chocolate chip cookie, hoping that it'll taste exactly the same but vegan. I'm sorry to say this is this is not exactly it. It doesn't have that butter. It tastes like, have you ever had a cookie that's made with flaky salt? It tastes like that. So it's a good cookie. It's just not giving me what I thought it was going to give me. Let's talk about it. P is gonna be for presentation and plating, AKA packaging. I mean, it's not giving you the traditional green taste packaging that you know and love. But I like this. It's easy to recognize in the store that this is Tate's, but it's different. So you get full points for me. Optics, these cookies look exactly like what you expect a Tate's bake shop cookie to look like. So in terms of, you know, sometimes when you make a vegan something, it doesn't look like what the originals looks like. Nah, this is spot on. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Um, and then price and punch. Uh, I think these cost the same as the regular Tate's. I will fact check and let you know in the comment section below, but I mean, in the description box, but uh, punch, like I said, now this uh, vegan vanilla maple, they onto something here. The chocolate chip, I don't know. I'm not sure about that one. But all in all, since there was only one thing that I didn't particularly love. I'm still gonna say it gets that Sister Girl Tuesday popping. It popped, y'all. So 
Let me know in the comment section below if you've tried Tate's Original and you tried the vegan. Let me know if you've tasted any of these and what you think. Um, you already know before you go. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time. Thank you.